right, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Indigo, and happy Thanksgiving to you and your families. Hope you guys have a good one and a safe one. Today I'm back with another AEW Dynamite review, and this was a thanks pre Thanksgiving edition, and what a show, man! What a show. You see, res wrestling themed shows like this during the holidays are great to see. It's so chill, it's laid back, and I just had a great time watching it today, as always. And we're going to talk about it, because a lot happened tonight. As y'all see in the thumbnail, we got one of the segments, if not the segment of the year, in all of pro wrestling. Uh, this was this was something I was waiting for ever since CM Punk came back to pro wrestling and AEW in general. We're going to talk about it. We're going to talk about it. Smash that like button, guys. Smash the like button. It's a fa it's basically a favor I'm asking of you guys. It's free. It takes you like three seconds. And I appreciate it. Leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on the show tonight. And let's do this. So, like I said, the show opened up with CM Punk and MJF. Dang. There's not much I can say. I, I tried to take some notes, but there's not much to say. If you guys missed the show tonight, definitely go go out your way and watch Dynamite because this this is worth your time. It went damn near 20 minutes, 20, 30 minutes. And again, I said this I said this on Twitter. They could have talked the whole show and I wouldn't have had complaints. <laughs> That's how good it was. And I also said that this was way this was more entertaining than the entire Survivor Series and the whole missing egg saga bullshit. And I'm still thinking about it right now. Like Dynamite just went off the air, and again, this was a this was a, an amazing opening. And if you guys missed the show, definitely go out your way to check out this segment. Just promo back and forth. I don't know when we get in a match, but when we do, it's gonna be a banger because these two. You guys know what they could do in the ring. So, CM Punk was supposed to be out here regardless because he was going up against quality te quality television Marshall, QT Marshall. And eh, it was quick. There's not much I can say about the match. It was just the MJF Punk segment that was fucking lit. <laughs> Next up, we got Eddie Kingston at 2.0. Daniel Garcia segment. We get in Daniel Garcia versus Eddie Kingston on Rampage, Black Friday edition. Next up, we got something that I feel should have been on Dark or Elevation, if you ask me. The Gun Club versus Bear Country. I wasn't really paying attention to this, so I don't know who won. <laughs> and eh. right now, Darby Allen is shooting with the Gun Club, and that's a downgrade in my opinion. Next up, we got Dante Martin, Leo Rush, and Team Taz segment. Um, basically, Dante Martin, he signs with Team Taz, but unofficially because he didn't read the contract. So we'll see what happens there. Um, next up, we got Thunder Rosa versus Jamie Hayden. Jamie Hayden. Oh, my fault. I'm, I'm doing a review. Um, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Um, great match. These are two of the best in the company. Then the Rosa advances. She will be facing my girl Jay Cargill in the um, quarterfinals of this tournament. And I said this previously in all my Dynamite reviews or AEW reviews in general. It's gonna be Then the Rosa and Ruby Soho in the finals, and I got Ruby Soho to win the TBS championship. Next up, we got. Well, let me say this after the match. Well, Britt Baker interfered and she basically super kicked Jamie Hayter, so Jamie Hayter wasn't really pleased with that. So she brushed her off her and um, Rebel. And straight after that, we got the Friendsgiving segment with Dr. Britt Baker, our AEW Women's Champion, Rebel, and Tony Schiavone. Um, it was an okay segment. Um, Tony said that Tony Khan. Went back and watched tape of the um, I believe it was the casino, but one of the casino battle royals, I believe, and Riho wasn't unofficially eliminated, so he gave her a match with Britt Baker on Rampage, 
Um, a Black Friday deal, I think, was the name of the theme of this match. If Miho wins, she gets a title opportunity in the future. But before you WWE geeks come at me talking about, oh, this is something WWE do, but in AEW, people won't complain. Again, Miho was, Tony Khan went back and studied tape on that Battle Royal, so this is something that makes sense. So, up yours to WWE version. Next up, we got Brian Danielson versus Cole Cabana. This was a freaking Ring of Honor throwback right here. These two have five trilogy matches, I believe, at the top. Oh, man. Their final match, because Brian Danielson beat Cole Cabana four times in that series. The final match was a draw. It was a, I think it was a 60-man. Yeah, 60-minute Iron Man match. And these, they got history. They got great chemistry in the ring. This is probably the first time a lot of people see, see saw these two wrestle, and you guys get in for a treat. Um, after the match, well, Brian Danielson wins, of course. Y'all see the shirt. Hangman, he calls out Hangman Page. Hangman Page comes out. They have a little um, fisticuffs, so to speak. <laughs> they went at it. Brian Danielson bails and. I can't wait for this match because it's going to be a banger. The main event tonight was Black, Andrade, and FDR versus Co Cody, Pac, and the Lucha Bros, our current AEW Tag Team Champions. This was a good match. Cody sucks. I hate his theme music. And he threw his weight belt in the crowd and somebody threw his back. <laughs> that was... That was the highlight of the match, if you ask me. <laughs> that was some ECW type shit to me. Because that shit was hilarious. And it also shows that Cody, he's hated right now. And just do the hell turn. And he will be more than happy to boo you. Because that's what we want to do. And who won the match? Um, Andrade wins. He got the pin. So they win the match. And... Dynamite went off the air. Um, that's all I got for you guys. Um, thank you guys for tuning in for the video again. Again, smash the like button. Smash the like button, guys. It's a favor of me asking for you guys if it's free. It takes y'all two seconds. Thank you. Please. And leave a comment. Um, if you guys missed any videos on the channel, they're there. I reviewed the Survivor Series. Oh, yes, unfortunately, I watched that crap. I review Full Gear, it's on the channel, and any other videos you missed, if you guys are into One Piece, I celebrated the thousandth episode of that, and it was a great episode, and I loved it, and um, I'll catch y'all next time, take care, and um, have a great Thanksgiving.